This is the last week of Jerry Brown's fourth term as California governor. It will officially end on Monday. Brown has picked his next home in the rolling hills of rural Calusa County. And new tonight, CBS 13 Steve Large is at the governor's mansion in downtown Sacramento with a big change ahead for the governor out of public life. This is a road far removed from the political landscape Governor Jerry Brown so successfully navigated in his career. With cow pastures replacing hustle and bustle, this road leads right up to Governor Brown's next home in Calusa County, where the California state flag is raised and ready for his arrival. Brown's home named Mountain House 3, after his great-grandfather's home on this same land, is newly built, 2,000-plus square feet with solar panels up for reusable energy. The governor has made frequent trips here in recent years preparing for full-time use. We usually meet him on the road. Um, he's in his ranger with his dog and Ann. Deanna Jarrett is a rancher and Brown's new neighbor. It will be interesting. Politically, Calusa County has not loved the politician Jerry Brown. He did not carry this county in any of his four campaigns for governor. I was not um, one of his supporters. Yet Brown has professed his love for the county in pictures, posting photos working on his property. Jarrett says families that work this land for livelihood don't want him to try turning it into a nature preserve. This is a lot of people's livelihood, the ranching and the farming that goes along with this. So it's not just loving nature, it also has to support the families that surround here. The governor moving into this rural Calusa County. And he always questioned, who are you? I said, who are you? Welcome to the neighborhood. And a live look now at the governor's mansion, the current residence of Jerry Brown. He moved in here, as we all know, back in 2016. He will be having a very different view of the street outside his windows. No more city streets very country and rural to where he's moving now. I did have a chance to talk to that neighbor who said that she's already noticed a big change that's come before the governor has moved in. They have recently paved the roads. All right, some big transitions ahead. Steve Large, life rest in downtown Sacramento. Thank you, Steve.